There's a bear cub in our lower pasture there. You can see him, right? Where is he? Right there. That might not be a cub. It's not a cub? Looks too big to be a cub. Looks like a big sow. Yeah. Miss W thought it was a cub, but I don't think it is. No, now that I'm in the second story, it's... That's a big bear. Yeah. That's cool, huh? Yeah. Well, I'm glad I ran earlier. She's down there eating the wild strawberries, our, uh... uh all in down there. She's down there. Every year they come through there like a vacuum cleaner scooping up those alpine strawberries. I was running through there about an hour ago. Surprised right, you didn't see her. I was loud. I saw her last week. That is a big bear. Yeah. No, it won't really won't come through. It's just too far away. Okay. Can you see it in the video? Yeah, I can see it. I've got my uh, 250 millimeter lens on here. It's weird to think we have a bear so close and the other night the coyotes were going to woke us up. And the week before I ran into that family stunt. There's a lot of animals out here, huh? And there's a lot of wildlife. That is a really big bear, Mama. You think that's the one I ran into the other night? Yeah, that's a huge bear. We were going to go down see if we could go down there and get a closer picture of it, but I it's went back into the forest. Well, if it comes back out, we'll, we'll go down there. Mrs. W and I are out for a run. Lucy, what did you, what have you done? What'd you get? What is that? Lucy, what is that? What do you have? I'm not going to take it from you. Very proud. What'd you get? Did you get dinner? Oh, it's a squirrel. You're fast. It's a big squirrel. Good job, I guess. <laughs> Heart Racer likes to run too. How how far is Heart Racer? What do you say? About four miles? She's good. Four for and a half. She is half Jack Russell, which is the only reason she can do it, but four and a half. I, I don't like to take her more than three and a half, but sometimes it happens. So I'm such a lame runner that Mrs. W comes out and runs like a little short run with me. And she goes and does a real run afterwards. You are awesome, baby. It's not fun for me. You better run. Mrs. W doesn't like the squirrel. There she goes. That's better, huh? What happened to your stick you were carrying to fend her off? They always want to show me the animals. And I just like to make sure they're dead first. You know she's going to bring that in the house. No, she's not. Heart Racer, are you envious? Where's your squirrel? You are a squirrel. All right, let's go, Luz. There's a girl. I saw something so cute, we had to turn around here. I don't know if it's grouse or... Oh, it's so cute! Look. Are they little quail or little yeah, grouse? I, I don't know if they're grouse or... I think they're big quail. Look how small they are. There's animal tanking around here. Oh, look at that. Look at those babies, Mama. I think I'm out of frame. Okay. <laughs> it's hard to be tall, isn't We're it? We're equal now. But, would, but, but, you can, but you can always reach the top of the cabinet. This, would, this is what it would be like if you were married to Tom Cruise. It's better. We have an important announcement. Go ahead. <laughs> so this weekend, which is June 4th and 5th, we will be at the Mother Earth News Fair in Albany, Oregon. Cody will be speaking from 1 to 2 on Sunday. And then we'll have a book signing from 2 o'clock on. Yeah, our home state. We don't have to get on an airplane for this one. Woohoo! Very, very nice. Can't wait. So we have a free ticket giveaway. Mm -hmm. uh, how can um, anyone who wants to come to the fair uh, will get tickets? Now, children are free under six, Se 17 and under. 17 and under. So if you have a family, 
uh, that really helps out. Um, but we'll, if you like to have tickets for the Oregon Mother Earth News Fair, just leave a comment in this video, and we'll just we'll just pick uh, some folks from the from the comment section. That's right. And so um, they are two day wristbands. So um, if you get them on Saturday, they're good for Saturday and Sunday. Right. And uh, you'll get an email. They'll send you information at the gate. Uh, please check quickly because if you can't use them, we'll pass them on to somebody who can. And uh, if you do not win, order them online because you'll get a twenty five percent off the book, the book. Uh, store sale and it's a great bookstore with all kinds of books you want and you'll get special deals it's right. cheaper too than buying it at the gate so you want to buy online if yes. you don't get it ahead of time and this may be your only opportunity to get an official wrangler star pencil oh so we have carpenter's pencils and number two tyro ticonderoga pencils yeah so the only you know of course the only way you can get those is, you, is if you get them from us. So that's right and come out for the pencil if nothing else and today is tuesday and we're hoping to announce them tomorrow We'll announce tomorrow. Yeah, so it's kind of a right. short and quick, so hope you see the video. Yeah, Otherwise, the, we'll see you this weekend. Put your name in the comments, and um, that's it. Anything else? Oh, we're probably not going to have a meet and greet. Maybe we'll do another one in Oregon some other time this year. Well, we'll be there all weekend, so there'll be plenty of time to, uh, to get to chat. That sounds great. All right, we'll see you guys on the next video.